what's up? I'm doing a res video response to the guy that says we or he was going to help you show you how to create a new admin Mac OS X password. Bam! Sorry, wrong jackass. Um, what he showed you how to do was erase a file in OS X that brings you back to the setup assistant that does not reset an admin password, that does not create a new one. That creates a brand new administrator's account. Um, that will that is a roundabout way to uh, reset another password of a, a user's account. Um, but I wanted to show you the real way how to do that in the command line. And all I'm going to show you. So um, he showed you how to to mount the drive and the and how to boot up in single user mode and how to mount the drive. But I'm going to show you how to do it through directory services. So here we go. Um, that is going to be your command right there. DSCL. Um, space dot space uh, the dot stands for here as in this local machine um, then you're gonna do uh, the command PASSWD for password users and whatever users name is is uh, I don't know it could be I'm a total idiot if your name is I'm a total idiot then you know then you would reset the password for that um, but in order to start up directory services, this is what you have to do. Uh, after you've mounted the drive, this is the command that you do to launch directory services. Uh, launch control load because you want to load a, a preference list. System library. Launch daemons. And then com.apple.directory services local. And uh, so I, I get mixed results. Sometimes I have to do just local and then sometimes just directory services.plist. These are two actually two files. So but I usually just load that and then you know, boom, there you go. Um, and then it started up and then you run that uh, DSCL command. and then you know reset the password for a user or whatever but anyways I, I thought his video was a big campaign um, with misinformation on how to actually you know complete a task and the, the these both in the end complete the same task but this way it's it's a lot quicker you don't have to sit through this setup assistant create a new account reset it go back to the old account and then delete the new administrators account you just did um, this way is, I think, is quicker and it's more efficient. Unfortunately, if you forget your password, you're pretty much you're pretty much boned either way, because you know your keychain that stores all your passwords is, you know, gone forever gone. So if you have like a ton of credentials that are stored within the keychain, uh, it's gone unless you remember it someday. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions about you know using directory services or whatever, just you know PM me or leave your comment. I'd be glad to answer any questions.